this said that this is very a pro this is a problem for me because if I'm going to reduce this voltage, I cannot reduce to up to 30 volt, which is required. So my output is going to be high. But anyway, I have shown you this is just connected like this. Now this is the input wire which is going in the meter, and then we have got uh, this uh, dimmer, and then this is coming out of it, and we have got a board to connect it. Now what I'll do, I'll connect this board, this supply line over here. Now it is connected with the 220 volt line. Okay, I have turned it on and now you can see that uh, it's working it's working the bulb is working and I'm going to turn it on so now you can see the meter is running okay and the bulb is running glowing I can reduce it so that we can have a very low voltage the meter is not running because the bulb is very slow so this is it now what I do at the same time I'm going to connect my main board with it now when I connect my main board with it now it is coming taking all of these things at this point we want to take some measurements and this is the amperage which is going in so this is it is taking right now 0 0.64 amps this is taking uh, 0 0.4 amps of the uh, the current and the voltage is of 49 volts so this is the input which is going in in the genie right now which is going in directly in the board right now okay i disconnect it I will write it over here for my memory that we have given 0 0.4 amps and at 50 volts okay this is the input that is going in at this moment now coming to the second stage where we have got I should turn it off for a minute so now this is the wire which is this that was a third wire which we have got last time if you can see this is a 12 volt a simply 12 volt uh, adapter which is basically used to supply the circuit the 12 volt to operate so I'm going to put it like this and I'm going to turn it on when I will turn it on a light has started blinking over there which can show you that it's working this is the output board and this is the output board and this is the input board yeah this is the input board we will give low input from this side and the high output will come from this side now what we do we connect this uh, we just turn it on and so you can see the low input is going in right now okay we connect the board with the high output now this board is connected with the genie and genie is on low input are coming on this side we have not given any input to the genie so far so it is not going to work when I'm going to connect you will see this bulb will remain very low because the input is low and these bulbs these three bulbs they are going to run very fast now I'm going to connect it with the genie yeah? okay here you go now if you see the bulb is running very very slow the bulbs over here are running too fast the voltages which are here is around 300 and 48 uh, 338 volts okay if you can see it from here like this okay this is too high because because I cannot reduce it more than I cannot go to 30 volts my system requires only 30 volts and it is giving too much output now we will we want to check the inputs and outputs now this ampere meter is on AC okay I just check what is the input the input is 2.8 amps it is 2.8 amperes okay and let's see what the output is coming I will write it first now the input is 2.8 amps and the voltage was 59 when we take the input 59 volts was input now and you can see the bulb the bulb is just running very very light so this is what is the output is at the output we have got 1.33 amps 1.33 amps which is at the amps here yeah? and the the reading in the multimeter is 336 336 volts okay i write it 1.3 amps 336 volts okay 336 volts and 1.3 amps so i have i will have to calculate it now that how it is working again going to show you that if I'm going to remove the input from here 
you can watch this is the input this is the input which is at 60 volts i am removing this input yeah i have just disconnected the power from the u from this genie the input is this which we were giving and the output is this meter was running slow and everything is off now if i connect directly the genie from the load right now without the genie if i'm going to connect it directly this is the main board i'm going to connect it directly when i connect it directly this is the output coming in yeah this is the output which is coming out this is the output yeah and it is connected right directly ac going in the meter then the, the, then the dimmer from the dimmer it is going on the board from board we have got it over here to prove we have got a small bulb over here which is 60 watt bulb basically so if i'm going to increase you will see everything is going to increase the meter start running faster faster okay at this stage we have got 238 volts coming in okay and the ampere which is taking in is 1.33 okay 1.33 amps at 230 volts which is normally coming the meter speed you can see the meter speed now this is 1.33 amps and it is 238 volts yeah this is the load what is going inside this beside this one bulb is also there okay so what we have got it over here that we are taking sorry it's 1.07 which is going in the board other than the bulb yeah 1.07 amps yeah this is 1.07 amps going in at 238 volts 238 volts yeah this is which is input going in so now we are going to compare again that what will happen if we are going to connect and the speed is meters too high yeah now i'm going to remove it i have removed this thing and i'm going to put it to the down to the zero level I'm going to connect it to the output from the genie. The board is connected with the genie output. And again, I'm going to do it that I'm going to provide supply. Now you have to watch the bulb is not going to glow faster because it is the lower voltage. This is genie input. I give the genie to the input. Now you can see the bulbs are running far, far more brighter than before. The meter speed is slow. And you can see this is taking 337 volts 337 38 volts the output is 338 volts now let's see what the amperages are so the ampere which is giving output by the genie is 1.33 amps 1.3 amps is the amperage that we are taking we have taken it before now again 1.3 amps 33 amps at 338 volts 338 volts okay and this is the output this is the output genie is giving now i check the input input is 59 volts and it is giving 2.7 amps 2.7 amps at 60 volts 2.7 amps at 60 volts this is the input in the genie the proof is this that you can see the bulb is running so slow now if you want to go again i can do it again and again as many times you want it i remove this I remove this okay this is the genie is removed this is the output from the genie is removed the output coming from the main line is again very slow the meter is running slow meter will remain slow when I connect the genie now we come to this point that how we can calculate if we calculate right now if I just calculate right now 1.33 into 338 volts it is giving me 449 watts of output the gene is giving me 449 watts now if i go what the input was 2.7 amps into 50 volts 59 right, let's say 60 it is giving me 162 input i am giving 160 watt of watt of input and i am getting 450 watt of output in 